Hi guys, so I got another tarantula that I'm going to film. This one will be suitable for the beginners and intermediate people, uh, class of tarantulas. So, I thought I should choose to do this guy right here. Uh, this tarantula is known as the Phonopelma simani, which is known by several common names, either the striped knee, the zebra knee, Costa Rican zebra, and so forth. I really hate using common names, so I really resort to using the Latin names. Uh, so this is a New World Terrestrial that comes from, you guessed it, Costa Rica. Um, what you're looking at here is a four and a half inch female. Uh, these are the maximum size growing specimens. Um, there exists two color, three color forms. Uh, the one you're looking at is the blue form. Uh, there's also a brown form and what's really, really hard to come by uh, is a so-called green form, which I have yet to see. So you pretty much keep it like a rose hair. Very, very easy to keep. Um, make sure you always have a Cajun water dish. Uh, some substrate. Um, humidity around 75%, so you can just keep it by putting a water dish and missing it once a week. Should be suitable. Um, Temperament wise, uh, really, really don't you don't suggest you handling these types of species because some of them, like especially mine, can be quite hair kicking. The hair, the hairs of Phonopalmas aren't that bad compared to like um, you know the brachies and the uh, some of the bird eaters. But um, in general, they're very, very, very nervous tarantulas, so they're really, really skittish. But I mean by skittish is that will run at the slightest disturbance. So just because it's skittish, um, wouldn't suggest you handling it. Unless you, if you really would like to handle it, you really must handle it low to the ground because you really don't want to um, injure the tarantula by falling. But overall, it's a pretty cool species. You know, it's um, it's a nice tarantula to have. It's good for beginners. Very easy to take care of. But um, handling wise, I would not suggest you handling it unless you try to um, test this temperament. So the way I explained in many of my videos to test the temperament with the paint with the tarantulas is to use a soft paintbrush. You know, use the soft end and just gently nudge the abdomen. So we're gonna do that and see what happens. Okay. That means it's she, she tried to run away from the paintbrush. So she, but uh, she's she's an overall nice tarantula. I wouldn't, I don't handle mine because I've seen her a couple times uh, go into a threat posture and kicks hairs at me. So not a pretty girl. But anywho, she's a nice species. Um, great for beginners. Very easy to keep keep care of. Uh, but if you want a good tarantula that's very Hannibal, I don't recommend this one. I recommend either. Um, as I said, uh, either the curly hair, um, the Mexican red knee, the Chaco golden knee, and also the pink zero beauty. And of course, pink toes. Pink toes are excellent Hannibal tarantulas that rarely bite. And so here is my Phonopalma simani, four and a half inch female, adult female. So I hope you'd enjoy the video and um, more videos to come.